Hey everyone, it's Ashley from MLM Rebels, and today we are going to talk about just in case versus just in time information. This is something that uh, I learned from Tim Ferriss, and people ask him all the time. He does tons of interviews, his podcast interviews are normally two to three hours long, and he's constantly gathering all this information. And so people are constantly asking him, How does he remember everything that he learns and that he comes across? And you know what he says to them? He says, I don't. You know, he keeps a notepad by him when he's doing these interviews and he writes down one to three things that he takes away from that interview. And usually the one thing is something that he can implement in his life that day or in the next 24 hours. And the other two things are things that he can implement in the next 30 days. You know, he's not looking to take away everything. He's looking for those main things that are going to actually make an impact in his life at that very moment. And you know, something that I had to learn, like we need to just stop consuming information to just consume. Like we're not hustling by reading three books a month and then like literally doing nothing with it and putting nothing into action. You know, I think when we built MLM the old way, when we built it old school, like something we very much got caught in the trap of doing was just like consuming information, consuming information, reading books, trying to get edified, like whoever consumed the most information and like had the best reflections, like they got edified the most. And so it produced a system of people that continued to learn and learn, but never actually take that learning and put it into action. And, you know, don't be that person that's like at a conference and that's taking notes like on every single word the person said because it's taking you out of the moment it's taking you out of that presence and you're missing so much that's being said and quite honestly like for me that was so overwhelming for my brain like it didn't even know how to internalize what I was actually hearing and I was actually writing and then I walked away just like super confused so I think we can all myself included something I've really started to try and do is you know take Tim Ferriss's advice like start looking for that information that's just in time like that information that I can go put into action that I can use to move forward that I can use to make a difference in my life and in our business and when you start to do that it's gonna take so much pressure away it's gonna lighten your load it's gonna feel you make you feel like you're actually making progress you're moving forward and you have the right information at the right time so start doing that guys and I think it's gonna make so much progress for you